In 2005, YTF initiated the idea of the Golden Youth Award Camp to commemorate the 50th birth anniversary of His Majesty the Fort Truk Kelpo, Jimmy Singh Ewancho. The most outstanding person earns the title of the Golden Youth, receiving a scholarship to study in a prestigious college abroad. Every year, 80 young students selected from among the brightest from Trini Zonkals gather in Thimpu to compete for this Golden Youth title. Participants arrived at the Bhutan Institute of Wellbeing on the evening of 4th July 2019. A brief orientation was conducted on the same day to familiarize the participants with the Institute and the three days program. It has always been a part of my dream to attend this camp and here I am. And in today's session I learned how to attend happiness and inner peace and even prosperity in our life. And I get to know about myself even more. And for that I'm thankful to the community of Chimitanka for letting us get involved in this program and letting us know about ourselves even more than we used to do. The 12th UIA theme is a pledge of both youth and adults to be leaders and mentors for the current and future generations of Bhutan. A equals two Y, one adult equals to two youth. <laughs> Uh, Dilagi <laughs> It is the first day of the camp which brings together all the participants, volunteers, escorts, organizing committee members and camp coordinators in a common hall to orient everyone on a detailed camp activity. Golden Youth Award Camp aims to encourage participants to think beyond what they learn within the four walls of the classroom. The literary activity gives freedom of choice when it comes to language preference as it was found out that most of the expressions come with substance when they are given the liberty to choose language, English or Zonka. Let's
Again, the talent show is one of my favorite because we all at this participants could showcase our various talents that is within us and the program coordinator have provided a lot, lot of support to us and we are genuinely thankful for that. Right now I'm feeling very excited and happy, happy because I have so practiced so a lot for this moment, the talent so show, and I'm very excited as well. Every year, the talents round has been one of the most popular activity enjoyed by the participants. It is the second year that GYA encourages participants to perform in groups if there are any similar talents of interest. While this is encouraged, they are also given the freedom of individual performance. Today we attended the social entrepreneurship workshop and the term social entrepreneurship is a totally new thing to us but after attending this workshop it has become a lot clearer for us and we have understood what it is. From this we the youth understood that we do not need to solely depend on government occupations but could adopt new occupations that have not yet been adopted in our country. And what I think most important concept from this workshop is that we, the youth of a society, can greatly contribute in sustainable socio-economic development. We are still searching for the clues. We only got one clue and we are still searching for that. Right now, that clue is very hard, so we we tried in uh, the YVR room and the tent and we tried there in canopy and now we are going to try here la. We could not find the first clue and we are still stuck on that la. So any place the nesting place cheese, extra cheese, it's not always here the time. It's not here all the time. Okay. 
and all these life forms interact with the physical environment provide services to mankind. <laughs> Golden youth are the youth who are excellent in every aspect, be it academic or literary, and who are all-rounder. Moreover, as the title itself describes, golden youth are the youth who are precious just like the gold and who are worth of this camp. For me, golden youth doesn't mean that they own the hundreds of the gold. They are the youth who has thousands of the golden values that enriches their life. Led by Ms. Kamal Chaki, winner of 8th GYA camp, a group of YYers facilitated a day-long workshop on identifying the true self. The whole workshop surrounds on the quest of self-discovery as they discuss individual identities and come closer to true nature of the mind. The last day and last night, more than 300 high-level dignitaries, DEOs, principals and youth participated in the program. The His Majesty, the fifth Jukyal Po granted an audience to us. He imparted words of wisdom that are so precious in our life. He imparted us the importance of how much value, manners, and etiquette are important in our everyday life. Before attending this camp, I thought Golden Youth Award was all about standing out from the rest, trying to be the best, but after coming to this camp, I realized it's not about being the best, it's not about standing out from the rest, but it's about enjoying each and every moment with every other participant out here and winning as a team, not as an individual. The entire setup of the hall was based on the theme wherein an underwater scene, water life, was created to promote the sense of purity and fluidity. Pictures displayed across the corners of the hall allowed people to reflect on the sense of responsibility to nurture a child in the best way possible. The night was all about adults and participants making pledges to uphold one's responsibility as a genuine parent, adult and growing youth. For every adult who pledged to take care of two youth in their life, they were rewarded with a badge of appreciation and parachute of love to cherish the pledge they made.
you IDF, thank you all the participants for, for showing us a road ahead. Did we actually know it? That's a maybe yes. But did we actually feel it that hard? I really don't know. I was happy to hear one of the performers saying that whenever you come across these negativities in life, try to convert into positivities and exactly the that. Nashin Sergei Tamazimiri, Nidin, Visitiki Gogobunjila, Te Dari, Ni Charutsugi Bengalu, Dalto Bishina, Mimum Lexugi, Tama Dingalu, Jindalu, Semlu Gawada, Kulugas, Bomchira Juice Shuinla, the Siki Tole Lava Chindi, Nagi, Narai, Tonang, the Gachisunji Juga, the Sheta Mapra Mindus Shuinla, Kadisha. It was so unexpected. I never expected that I would get this award. And of course I did give my best, but I didn't hope to get this award. This camp was amazing. It made a better me. First of all, I'm very happy that I got this award. I'd like to thank everyone here, uh, including participants, for being so nice to me and uh, helping me create so many memories. And I'd like to say that it was, uh, a, I had a great time here. And I'd also like to say that um, every youth should aspire to become the best in everything. Uh, they can be jack of all trades, and it doesn't matter where they are, where, whether they are the master of none, because participation is the most important thing. And if you try everything, then you'll know what you're best at. So I think that everyone should, should aspire for excellence and not for competition. <laughs> I'm so stunned right now. I was not expecting anything, honestly. And to come second, to be first runner-up, is just amazing to me. Uh, I'd like to thank my school, ELT High School, my parents, my lovely parents. I'd like to thank the, His Her Majesty, the Gellium, for organizing this event, for teaching me so much. And I'm so happy that I got to be a part of it. I'm so, I'm so happy to get this right. I think uh, when the most deserving person in a deserving girl, thank you very much. As of now, I'm actually very honored and I'm actually very happy. And the only word that can describe my emotion right now is happy. And I really want to go back home and call my parents and tell them that your daughter did it. Yes, I did it.